Hello guys, David here and welcome to this video. In this video guys, I'm gonna showcase my technical analysis tool that I just created. This technical analysis tool uses only the price data. It doesn't use any other input. It doesn't use fundamental. As it is right now, it's producing outstanding results doing some bad tests. So before I go into testing it, I'm going to show you exactly how it was created. So the first thing is the API. I created an API for me to actually get data from MT5, any kind of data from any time frame on demand with this API. I can request right here. I requested SAUSD. I requested future candles from future from the date that I'm requesting one minute. This will help me to actually see what the market would have done. Firstly, we want to do analysis. We want to predict where the market is going to go. After our prediction, we're going to do an evaluation of our prediction that is being done here by this AI agent. And it's going to use the data from the future to see if the market would have played out what we predicted or not. So the first thing that we're going to do here, we're going to set a date that we're going to pretend as if it's now. That date could be any date, right? This date uh, currently is right here. So we're pretending that we are on the 1st of April. We're going to get the data of how the market would have played out. So as you can see that we also have time right here. Uh, it's 15. Zero, zero, okay, so at 15.00, zero, zero, what we want to do is we want to get the next six candles and see how the market would have played out in the next one hour. And we're going to take it straight into this uh, evaluation chain. In this evaluation chain, so we're going to evaluate what this AI agent for analysis here would have given us and see if it is going to be actually a win. This is a Google Sheet that I created. Um, where we're going to store the results and see what the results are and actually evaluate. So I also have a basic form that I have here that is going to be sending, you know, some requests for analysis. This form is going to help me to test uh, the form date and the two date, which means I'm going to be testing multiple dates and multiple time at the same time. As you can see that the analysis gets uh, different types of data that is going to come into this AI agent that we provided with the data. All the results, we see them in the Google Sheets. I've got a Google Sheet right here. As results will be coming in, we'll be checking the Google Sheet to see exactly what's really going on. So I'm going to run a test right now. All right, so I'm going to run this test right now. So each and every day, we're going to test trading at 1 o'clock, 8 o'clock, 13.30, 15 o'clock, and 19 o'clock for XAUSD each and every trading day for this whole week. So let's see what's going to happen. Let me uh, submit. All right, so it's happening. Let me come to the executions and see if execution is actually running. Okay, so we got that execution running. Okay, that's good. All right, so let's see. Uh, all results will be in this Google form so okay so the first results just came and the net profit is 50 right so that was uh, the trading day was at the 7th of April and at 1 o'clock 1 o'clock to 8 o'clock we got a loss at 8 o'clock but as you can see that it's smaller than the profit that we made at 1 o'clock and that's fine. Let's see what's going to happen during the day. All right. So the results are coming in. That's another loss of uh, minus seven. So I think I'm going to fast forward this so that uh, I don't waste much of your time. Hey guys, I'm back. As you have seen there, um, so sometimes uh, some of the executions did fail. So I just have to redo them like these three ones that failed. I had, I had to redo them. Now I've got complete data as to what really, really happened. Here it says error. Let me see. Okay, I think it's supposed to be a number. So I'm just going to 
remove that and keep it as a number as you can see as well here keep it as a number all right cool let's see let's get the sum column over here okay so we got 52 but uh basically what i've discovered is that my broker when it says so when it comes to points it underestimates the points by like three comma or three digits all right so as you can see right here it's about 2000 points already so here it's actually underestimating the points so what i'm gonna do now is i've Discover that it underestimates by a thousand so so it becomes like that yeah so we actually have 52,014 points so let's just round it off like that these are the amount of pips that we've got so as you can see we've got one two three four five trades in a day and we've got one two three four five trades in the so we got five trades five trades per day complete done and we actually made about 5,000 pips in profit. Realistically, let's say 0 0.1 each and every trade, then we calculate. So per each trade, we need a margin of, because our leverage is 1 to 2,000, we only need a margin of 300 Rand. So which means that we can, okay, let me put this in dollars so that people can understand properly uh usd okay so if it's in dollars we only need 16 dollars to open a 0 0.1 lot size and but obviously we need more money to cover um, the losses if losses could happen so you can start with a an account of let's say 200 500 right and per each trade is taking a margin of uh, 16 uh, 16 usd so you can start with 200 500 thousand the more money you have the better because you are able to take some losses here and there as you can see this system is not 100 percent uh doesn't have a 100 percent win rate but it has an overall win rate as you can see right here we just took a random week and we ended up making about uh five thousand pips right on on go 5201 pips times 0 0.1 so you would have made 520 usd uh, that week right so this is totally totally amazing guys so i'm just going to show you an example of how it can be used in arisa.trade so this is arisa.trade I'm just going to log in right here. All right. So I'm just going to go to AI analysis. All that you have to do is come here at any given time uh, at, at one o'clock, like those times that I put right there. Then you click on XAUSD. Then you click on analyze. All right. When you click analyze, it will start analyzing. The model that I showed you for technical analysis will also be put onto the arisa.trade platform all right so as it is analyzing it will be using uh, different as you can see you will get your analysis like that it will come with stop loss and tp right? as you can see it says open but with the technical one it will come with tp and tp1 tp2 and stop loss and all that you have to do is to make sure that your ea is online or your EA is running, like when it's running on the VPS, it means I can trade from wherever I am. So if I click enter all, right, that means uh, trades are going to be entered onto my VPS. As you can see, the trade has been entered right here. Okay, then the tap profit and the stop loss will be copied. Right here, the, it was open. Obviously, the technical one will be providing stop loss and TP just as it is providing right here. Let me show you where the stop loss and TP provides. As you can see, it provides stop loss and TP just like that. If it's a sell stop, it will give you price. So all that you have to do is click on enter trade and then it will create the pending order for you. 
and you're done. All this can be achieved on Arisa Do Trade platform. We can also, for interest sake, you know, run another test maybe for another week, um, two weeks, a month, you know, uh, as we see fit. But according to the test that I've made so far, it is very, very, very good. So that is the new technical analysis agent that is coming to Arisa Do Trade. So just to give you a heads up, guys, we'll be running a big, big promotion with one of our partners to give you access to Arisa for absolutely free. So the first 50 lucky people will be able to use the Arisa Do Trade platform for free. More details on this are going to follow. Cheers.